What's going on YouTube? How you guys doing? All right, so the second quarter of uh, 2019 is almost over. So stay the business. Uh, video, here we go. It's uh, we're, we're crazy busy. We're slammed. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, I pushed basically my entire schedule back. I had a couple jobs just taking longer than usual for change orders and, you know, things that we couldn't foresee really. Uh, so I pushed everything back at like a three weeks and I'm still booked. Like it's, it's not even, it's not even... I mean, that's a good problem to have, but man, uh, yeah, anyways, so, and I, it, I'm booked because I have smaller jobs I need to get to, you know, customers are just like, hey, whenever you can get to me and I can, you know, I just want to get them off my schedule, get them done, taken care of, um, and then move on. Uh, as a, This is uh, end of the second quarter of 2019, so July and August are almost already booked completely. I leave a couple of days here and there for, uh, for small lucrative jobs, but... As far as large jobs, uh, what I have for uh, next month is a job in Oxford, tearing out a complete ceiling, uh, deck. Uh, there's gonna be there's gonna be rot repair stuff like that. So who knows how long that could take? That you know, I'm guessing two two and a half weeks, but it could take longer than that as well, just because uh, who knows what you can find in there. And it's you know painting the entire ceiling. The you know it's it's a lot of work. I'll subcontract out some of it, but uh, you know it's it's money. Um, and then August, I have um, another job. I want to say it's a low voltage, uh, you know, programming stuff, but also it's a bathroom. They have a steam shower. The steam, the steam part's actually been leaking inside their tile and into their second, uh, underneath their flooring for I think years. So who knows? You know, I quoted them. Uh, just demo every, you know, demo what I need to. Um, and it's basically like an open book because you, you never know what you're gonna run into so it could be drywall first floor and second You know, it could be that could be a month-long process, too. So that's August um, You know days here and there for smaller jobs like usual and then after that I have um, Most I had to bid on an Edward Jones uh, job uh, To revamp their entire office for us uh, for one of their offices which the from what I from what I've guessed is, is it's gonna be between uh, from what I what I've been kind of hankling on, as far as what I've been told, what needs to be done, it's going to be between twenty nine to forty five grand, as far as the job is going to be concerned. So that's uh, that's not set in the set in stone yet, but that's after that. So that's probably going to take me over a month, uh, between one and two months, really. So oh, it's going to be more than a month. So over over a month, less than two and a half months, we'll say. So and that'll put me into October, give or take. So that's where we stand. So. Um, as far as lessons learned, I learned uh, that I need to not overextend myself and give extra time. If I think it's like three days, basically make you know make sure there are six days available. Um, I learned a couple of lessons as far as planning work. Um, yeah, I mean as far as payment wise, I haven't you known. Every says you know customers sometimes stiff you. I haven't had any problems with customers. Uh, you know I choose them wisely. I'm, the customers that deal with me are super cool. Um, I had a couple, you know, people as far as, you know, kind of get a little, you know, fine, be like, you know, like when I sell them, I'm, I'm charging them for an estimate or they want, you want me to drive out there for their 15th quote or whatever it is for their job. So no, um, so that, that's definitely helping doing estimates over the phone and via, not even, not even showing up. It really saves me a lot of time. I still need to streamline. I think I'll, I'll, uh, help, uh, <laughs> ask my wife to help me with the QuickBooks as far as streamlining quotes. Uh, getting them into QuickBooks that way. It's just a one line item and I can have it all um, I just need to be better at my books uh, uh, As far as the uh, money wise and share like, you know all that kind of stuff, uh, you know the bookkeeping I'm still I'm getting better, but it's still it's still there's a lot of room for improvement a lot of room for growth and still learning uh, But it's there um, Yeah, that's them um, as far as that's other other than that guys. That's pretty much a state of it um, Yeah yeah, like and subscribe. Um, I'll be doing this once a quarter. 